Hi, I'm Richard, and this is a video on how to de deploy a Visual Studio web application to a AWS Elastic Beanstalk. I have set up my Elastic Beanstalk here uh, with the sample application that um, comes with it. So when you go to it, it's just a yay, you're winning kind of page. So we'll go to Visual Studio. And this is my application. It's uh, the blog you just saw here. Very basic, not much to it. I've installed the AWS plugin for this. All you have to do is log in, and uh, it takes care of the rest. So this is the sample. Oh, the what is currently the sample application. So I'm going to redeploy. It's not really redeploying. Uh, don't check this. If you have this checked, things don't work. It normally fails. I'm, I'm sure someone can, some people, I'm probably wrong, but for me it doesn't work. Use my existing environment and finish. And deploy. And it's going to deploy, hopefully. 50%. This is very exciting. That they are micro micro instances, so they 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 take a while because they're only itty bitty little things. So it's deployed successfully. It's still updating. So what you do now is uh, you go for a cup of tea. So I'll be back. All right, so now I've got my cup of tea. I came back and I found this is green, which means everything went well, I guess. Uh, so we'll launch the application, and hey, it came up. Sometimes it doesn't come up first time. You have to try a little bit. Uh, but once it's up, it seems pretty stable. Uh, so now I can start blogging, and people can read, maybe. Uh, yeah, thanks for watching the video, and I uh, hope this helps someone. Thanks, bye.